So the biggest challenge for me that I get asked about is how do I convince my client that this is the right thing for them? And I consider that my job is about 80% sales. I sell the vendors, I sell myself, I sell everything, I sell the design and the ideas and all that good stuff. I also ask my client not to pin wedding-related items. I ask them to please pin anything but wedding-related items. Because I'm not asking them specifically for what type of wedding look are they looking for in those images. I want to see things that make them feel good, things that inspire them. I don't care what it is, just as little wedding-related as possible. That way I know what their, what their personal style is. And I base my design on things that are not already in my portfolio. I work in a trust business with my clients. They trust me to do the absolute best job that I possibly can, and I trust them to give me all the tools that I need to be honest with me about what their budget is, tell me what their priorities are, and then I promise them I will churn out exactly what it is that they want. So I absolutely tell my client before they even hire me that you're hiring based on trust. So. Another question that gets asked to me is, how do you stand out? So I show the types of events that I want to produce. Not every single event is necessarily going to be Instagram worthy or pin worthy or whatever term you want to use. Sometimes it's just one thing out of that wedding that I find to be spectacular that I'll post that one thing. So I don't feel like every single thing that I want, that I do, I have to show. I also, if you look at our website, show very few photos of couples. I show a lot of decor because that's what we do. So it doesn't make any sense to me to show 14 photos of the bride and groom. They may be happy as clams about their wedding. Absolutely models. But for me, looking at them isn't going to give the client the feeling that they're sitting in that photograph, that this is the place where they are, that they could picture themselves there having dinner at that table. So it's usually one photo of the client. And I have been known to upgrade the events as necessary. If I think that the party needs a different chair, I will spend my own money on that chair to make it better. And that really is how I built my portfolio initially, as I spent a little bit of my own money to upgrade things. I'd add a charger plate, or I'd add a new chair, or I would just add things that made it really, really special. So I don't find anything wrong with doing that. And in fact, if you're trying to build a portfolio, it's a really good way of just making the party just a little bit better.